Hey, what's up guys? My name is Tom, or DKOVLD, and welcome back to another YouTube video over on the Tasty channel. Yes, I'm back speaking over Tasty's insane gameplays. Oh my goodness. It's been a while since I've spoken over on this channel. For those of you who don't know, new subscribers, I actually dual channel with Tasty quite a while back. I've also been in two of the same teams as him. Now to be the third team, because I just joined Darkness as well. Just like Tasty did, I was in Razor and Impact with Tasty, and he's a really, really cool guy, and thank you to him for letting me speak over another gameplay. So what you're actually going to be watching in the background is a world record gameplay. Woo! It's actually the world's fastest solo DNA bombing ranked play and you managed to do it in three minutes and 40 seconds playing hard points on the map retreat with the a mix between the ak-12 and the battle 27 now battle 27 and the ak-12 are two decent guns you see in esports a lot that the battle 27 is used alongside the asm1 and the more sniper rifle they're just three of the most common guns in competitive because it seems to me that the esports teams just decide you know let's just choose the best guns and then just stick to them and just use them constantly throughout and it makes sense to be honest it's a good tactic so ak-12 the battle 27 battle 27 is common but the ak-12 isn't so common which makes this dna really cool as well not only for the fact that he's only playing against four people managed to get the dna in three minutes 41 seconds uh, but he's also playing hard point where the spawns are pretty random and also he's using two guns at the same time so that's pretty cool so make sure you drop a like on this video if you did enjoy subscribe to tasty if you are new and also if you enjoyed the commentary then make sure you come check my channel out my link will be down in the description below so i'm going to speak a little bit about esports in general what do you think about esports i know i think it's today when i'm commentating now the 5th of august that the actual esports reveal is going on uh, for treyarch for the newest black ops 3 and I can't wait for that to be honest, it's going to be pretty fun. I always enjoyed watching esports and I think that Advanced Warfare made it pretty interesting as well. I think that now because esports is growing and growing and growing, it's becoming quite a pretty well known sport. Uh, you know, MLG have taken it off and uh, EGL, all them tournaments, hosters, they are uh, really big, lots of money can be won. And I think to be honest, that because esports is growing so fast, Call of Duties tend to focus a lot on esports now. So you see that Advanced Warfare is really heavily catered towards uh, esports and Black Ops 3 just as much as well. We saw Black Ops 2 really, really start and kicked off properly in Black Ops 2 where they did League Play and that was absolutely fantastic. Absolutely loved League Play. And then, you know, it's developed and developed and developed to it is now. And you see now that there are uh, team exos you can get so the optic exos there and so uh, are other exos too and it's really really cool it's awesome to see that esports is growing so big and to be honest i reckon that besides pub stomping esports is probably one of my favorite communities in general because it's just it's so much fun i used to play a lot of esports when i played call of duty ghosts uh unfortunately no one's on the ps4 so i couldn't actually you know, take it a little bit further because if it was on the xbox 360 xbox one then maybe maybe so but anyway guys uh so i really hope you enjoyed this commentary in the background the video is coming towards an end right now so as i said hope you enjoyed make sure you drop a like if you did enjoy this video if you enjoyed the commentary my link to my channel and twitter will also be in the description below so thank you very much for watching guys my name is tom or dk and i hope to speak to you all in my next video peace